met while Rachel was studying for her boards for OT. She figured she would try out Tender just to see how it would go. When she saw Chris, she thought, guys from the Midwest are nice, and he has a verse on his profile. So she swiped right on that one. Rachel and Chris did not meet by chance. Yeah, they met on Tinder, but they also met as a result of a lot of prayer and faith, and God delivered. Christopher, take Rachel to be your wife. Will you love her, comfort and keep her, and forsaking all others, remain true to her as long as you both shall live? I do. I will. <laughs> <laughs> do you, Rachel, take Christopher to be your husband? Will you love him, comfort and keep him, and forsaking all others, remain true to him as long as you both shall live? I will. Awesome. Chris and Rachel have written their own vows for each other. Rachel. <laughs> I promise it'll be short. <laughs> I vow to have you as my partner, seeing your words and feelings as equal to my own, that I am not above you, but the other part of who you are. I vow to have adventures with you, struggling and conquering all of life's challenges together in whatever form they may come, and to support us when we are trying new and crazy things, which we are most certainly going to do. I vow to be your greatest champion, advocate, believing in you always and in everything you will do. That I would make known your strengths and defend your honor in the face of all who would attempt to tear you down. That when people see me, they will see the best of what you are in my actions. I vow to love you in all times, all ways, and in all things. That you are my treasured joy and the beauty of my life. That you will be the pursuit of my heart faithfully from now until the end of time. <laughs> you entered my life as if you'd always been in it, attending Horizon Church, making friends with my friends, and those friends becoming our second family. <laughs> you became a part of my life, and I began to not be able to imagine without you in it. I vow to serve and comfort you in times where you need it and dance with you in times of celebration. I vow to always love you just a little bit more than a puppy. <laughs> and most importantly, I vow to love you every day for the rest of my life, honoring you, cherishing you in whatever form is needed on that day to the best of my ability. 
just like the verse, 1 Corinthians 16, 14, let all that you do be done in love. This is my lifelong goal, to let all I do in this marriage be done in love. I've never been done 